Yo. Feels good. Um. Yeah, I know what to do. Just um, just record this shit. And put it on YouTube, whatever. It's a war. Nah, I got a I got a bad cold, man. I got a bad cold. I just came down from like a bad bad cold, like a bad flu or some shit. I don't know. I've been sick. I I've been sick these past two weeks, so. I do sniff a lot when I'm sick. And I'm not talking about sniffing drugs, so chill out. I don't do that. I don't do drugs, I don't do coke, I don't do all that stupid shit. So just relax. All you drug happy motherfuckers, just calm down. I don't do drugs. I know you insecure about that man that you like doing drugs, but I'm not here to co-sign your drug habits, so. If you like doing drugs, that's you. I don't have nothing to do with that. But, um... Yeah. So, yeah. Because all my dogs know Kirk. Come on, man. Y'all niggas play too much. Chill, chill. It's not a time to be playing. Like, all my dogs snow cocaine. Okay, great. Great point. Why the fuck am I even responding to you this morning? Y'all gotta, y'all gotta chill, like, for real, for real. It's not a time for that shit. But, yeah, anyways. Um. Look, I'm not here to talk about medication and, and, and medicine and shit. I'm here to talk about some real shit. So, I advise that y'all just shut the fuck up and listen. Like, stop trying to be fucking Dr. Phil. Just shut the fuck up. So anyways, like I was saying, um, <sighs> we lost somebody. The, the, the Florida scene lost. The Florida team. The scene. Whatever you want to call us. We lost somebody. Big. We lost a uh, we lost an important player. Um, uh, uh, we lost the MVP in our, on our team on this Florida shit. Um, and I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Can y'all hear me clearly? <laughs> Do y'all hear me? Cause I don't know. The fuck you mean when I think about Soldier Kid, bro? He didn't do shit. Leave him alone, bro. All right, y'all hear me? All right. Look. So, we lost our MVP, bro. This MVP was like, it was weird. He was like a baby brother of mine. Um, he was a, he was a dark angel like me. He was a dark angel. Um, he, he, he got on the song with Denzel and Ski Mask, you know, I guess when they dissed me or whatever, but, you know, that's what little brothers do, you know? I was being hard on Denzel at the time. And you know, X 
wanted Denzel to fight back. So, that's all it was. I mean, X never hated me. X met my brother Gaddafi. I FaceTime X last year. We spoke on FaceTime. <laughs> he he was shocked to see me on FaceTime. He was like, "Oh shit, that's perk!" Like he was low key happy to see me. I know it caught him off guard because you know I wanted to say it was up. He he said love. I said love back, you know. We FaceTime, we kicked it. Said a few words, got off the phone. Um, I know from that day on, he felt, he probably felt more at peace. Cause, you know, when you the little brother, especially the baby brother, you always want the big brother to respect you, so I know he wanted to to earn my respect as a as an older brother, you know, Floridian brother. And when I was his age, I dropped Black Land Radio. He was 18 when, you know, when he first came out, like when he first hit mainstream, not mainstream, but when he first, you know, hit the, whatever, hit, 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 hit the limelight, yeah, hit the limelight. Yeah, he been earned my respect. You know why he earned my respect? Because... He earned it through his art. Not the trolling shit he did. Not the Takashi shit. Not the, you know, go, going, you know, trolling at a gas station saying I didn't pull up type shit. Nah, that's, that's just typical young nigga shit, man. That, that shit didn't bother me. I know he was trolling me. I know he was trying to get his fans up and it worked. It worked. It worked, you know? And then he... But when he got out of jail, you know, he, he did an interview and he mentioned me, mentioned my name. And he's, you know, because he know I, I'm his big brother. He know I'm his big brother. I didn't really get a chance to talk to him. And if and Bruno, if you hear this shit, bro, I'm going through a lot of shit, bro. I really, I really wish I was there to talk to him. I really wish I was at your crib when he was there. I guarantee, if he, if if I saw him. At your crib, this shit wouldn't have happened. Period. It wouldn't have happened, bro. X X was a um, dark angel, just like me. And it's a war between dark angels and wicked ass people. And think about. These dudes, whatever, rob, whatever, robbing, who robbed him, or whatever. I'm just dis, I'm disappointed in, you know, niggas that claim the streets for Florida. Because y'all know, X, it's not even worth even robbing on that level for you to try to get points to rob somebody like that and kill him you ain't getting no you you don't get no points for that 
So I'm disappointed in the streets, the street community of Florida, though, South Florida, because we don't get down like that out here, you know? Real street niggas don't do that. At it with real street niggas. And if they do rob somebody, they gonna kill a white dude. They gonna rob a white motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? They're not gonna rob no innocent black boy. Who's tiny? He's little. He's little. He's... He's small, man. He's he's little, bro. He's a he he a grown ass man. He's a young, he's a kid in my eyes. He's a kid, bro. Are you go kill a kid. And then try to talk that street shit afterwards. Like you a real gangbanger. First of all, let me tell y'all niggas something. It ain't no gangbangers in Florida. If you see any nigga in Florida trying to gangbang, bro, slap that nigga in his mouth. All right? Now, as far as the drill culture, yeah, that did start in Miami. That started in Miami. It did. Okay? But that shit is over with. All right? The only people still keeping that drill shit alive is Chicago and somewhat New York. All right, that that stick drill shit started in Miami, though, dog. All right, that shit started in Miami in 2007, 2007. Yeah, I say 2007. That shit started in Miami. Now, Broward and all these other cities, that's Broward, Palm Beach, um, Tampa and all that shit. Bro, country ass niggas, cut it out, bro. Not all that gang banging shit, y'all niggas. Like all these niggas trying to be, even niggas in Miami, y'all niggas get out that fake gang banging ass shit. Like, fuck out of here, bro. Like, Chicago, New York, Memphis, and Houston, Texas, and New. Did I say New York? Yeah. Let me say it again. Chicago, New York, L.A., Memphis, and Houston, Texas. All right, gang banging capitals of America. Let's keep it 100, all right? <laughs> Miami, Florida. Uh, Florida, period? No, it's not game banging. It's not, it's not, no. It's, it's drill. It's all drill shit. It's just drill. Niggas, niggas drilling shit. That's all it is. Stick drill shit, niggas. Shoot toting sticks. Just drilling shit. That's all it is. It ain't no gang banging in Florida. That don't exist. It's real drill shit. There's no trap shit. That, that trap shit is Atlanta. That's Atlanta all day. But Florida, that is drill shit, period. That's drill. That's all drill. So... All that fake ass gang banging shit niggas be trying to be on. Get the fuck out of here with that shit. All right. All this fake ass. I'm trying to get my street cred up. Get the fuck out of here with that shit. Y'all niggas don't get no cool points for running up on X, taking that nigga like. shit out <laughs> Mark Force fuck ass nigga March Force <laughs> nigga talking about ill y'all some virgin ass niggas
you know, I got a cold. This the first time y'all niggas heard me, like, with a cold. Y'all niggas is so whack. Y'all, like, y'all niggas never heard nobody have a cold before. Like, oh, my God, he has a cold. Oh, he has a cold. Who gives a fuck, nigga? I got a cold. What the fuck, nigga? Fucking virgin ass nigga. <laughs> niggas act like a nigga can't have a cold. Nigga, my nose stopped up. Nigga, my nose been stopped up since I started rapping, nigga. How many of y'all niggas heard my songs and I fucking sound like my nose stopped up, nigga? That's because I get hot fast, nigga. I like to be under the AC all day, nigga. The fuck? Some weird ass niggas. Nigga, I'm outside, nigga. I'm gonna spit on the floor. What the fuck? My fucking nose, bro. This shit broke. Niggas talking about ew. Ooh, ew. The thick, ew. Fuck out of here, nigga. I'm sick, nigga. <laughs> Having a cold is low key gay. Yo, you hella is. Yo, you gotta be like scared to come out the closet. <laughs> Anyways, bro, niggas is weird. <laughs> bro, chill, 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 bro. <sighs> Anyways, bro. Like I was saying. Yeah, back to the topic. Real nigga shit, dog. That shit hurt, bro. It hurt. It hurt because... The way it happened, it just, it baffles me. Because I, I knew what the fuck X was doing this the whole time. He been doing his shit. And it's like, people did not understand it. And I wish I, I would message X over and over. Not over and over, but I would message him some like, maybe twice, three times. Telling him certain shit, hoping he'll see it. <laughs> but to be honest, X X was better off not rapping, bro. Cause as soon as he started doing that music shit, his life got tragic. Like I watched his life go from sun up to sun down, bro. All the problems just piled on him back to back. I'm just like, God damn, bro, that shit is crazy. <laughs> hey, get the fuck off my shit, bro. You was a bitch ass nigga. How you how you don't don't ever disrespect me or him like that on my shit, bro. G shit. <laughs> Fucking weird ass niggas. <laughs> niggas gay, bro. Niggas ain't got no respect at all. That shit fucked up, bro. It's like... It, it hurt. It, it hurt me because I'm like... It hurt me because I know his dad is like torn. He's I know he's torn. 
because I know his dad wish he was here in America to see his son. Anyways, yeah. So many people always said, you know, <clears throat> X really looks up to you. I looked at them like, bro, y'all don't have to tell me that. I know who X is. Spiritually, I know who X is to me. I just wish that. I wish that I had a chance to, to get a hold of him and talk to him so he, he would not get caught up like that. And to all you bitch ass niggas in Florida, it's talking about y'all real street niggas. Y'all niggas is not street niggas, bro. Like, stop it. Y'all niggas not street niggas. It's only, it's real street niggas out here. Yo, one thing I hate about niggas in Florida, especially South Florida, is that niggas be trying to be hard and shit, right? But I see through that shit. Half you niggas that claim Florida not even wasn't even born in Florida. Real Florida niggas don't do shit like that. I'm sorry, dog. Like nah like real Florida niggas don't do that. Like dude 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 gotta be from like he got to be from somewhere else and just had to move to Florida when he was in high school. <laughs> Nigga, fuck Florida, to be honest. What is Florida? What is Florida without me, bro? What is Florida without X? What is Florida without Kodak? What is Florida? Fuck Florida. I don't owe Florida shit. Florida can suck my dick. Niggas in California went harder for X than niggas in Florida did. Niggas rioted for X in, in California. But niggas in Florida didn't even do shit. But y'all some real niggas, right? <laughs> Come on, bro. Let's be honest. Where will Florida be right now? If I want to make Radio Clan, if I want to came out with Black Land Radio, where will Florida be at?
on the floor be at? You know, you know who, you know who will still be the face of Florida? Flo Rida, nigga. <laughs> and Pitbull. That's who will still be the face of this Florida shit in 2018. If I wouldn't have fucking got my ass up and said, you know what? I'm going to drop music. Stop beefing with everyone. With everyone and make music. Who am I beefing with? Am I beefing with you? <laughs> like you're you're you 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 a really emotional ass nigga. You know that. <laughs> Emar, you another emotional ass nigga. And I and, and I I wish you niggas try to argue with me this morning. Cause I hate the morning. <laughs> now there's no smoke. Why would I have smoke with you, nigga? Do you know what smoke is? Do you know what real smoke is? You don't know what that is. Why is you speaking like that? Why is you saying them type of words? You're not even street. Why is you saying street lingo? Smoke. What's up with you niggas? That's why niggas is out here doing stupid shit. Because y'all niggas keep trying to act like y'all hood. Stop trying to be ghetto. You're not from the ghetto. You're not hood. Just be a proper nigga. Be proper. Be a good boy. Tuck in your shirt. And live your life, bro. Stop trying to be gangster, my nigga. Stop doing that. Just stop trying to be ghetto. Stop trying to be... Stop trying to be from the hood. You're not from the hood. Tuck in your shirt and be a good guy. You're a good guy, Luke. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> it ain't no American dream, nigga. Half of you niggas that live in America... Not even, y'all, I wasn't even born here. I was born in America. Half of you niggas wasn't even born in America. So how, why the fuck would I take you niggas serious? You're a foreigner. You're a foreign exchange student. Get the fuck out of here. This nigga Takashi is a Mexican. Talking about he's a blood. Get the fuck out of here, bro. A Mexican blood? Mexican niggas hate bloods. So why the fuck is a Mexican claiming to be a blood? What the fuck is going on? It's you dumbass niggas trying to act like y'all from the hood. You're not from the... There is no hood. I mean, that shit is over. Nigga, niggas in O-Block go to sleep at a certain time. So what that tell you? You think niggas got time to write a contract? Oh yeah, I'm gonna write a contract and be be hood on from um, nine a.m. to uh, six a.m. Niggas, being hood is not a job. You fucking idiot! It's some shit people was born in. But if you're forcing yourself to be hood, you're a fucking idiot. Take the Kanye West route, bro. That's a good dude, man. Take the Pharrell, take the Pharrell route. Take the Tyler, Tyler the Creator route. Why are you trying to be hood? <laughs> take the Lil B route. The niggas that... The niggas that robbed X, the, the nigga, the not hood, they're not hood niggas. I don't give a fuck if this message get back. Get mad all you want, nigga. Get mad. I don't give a fuck. What you gon' what niggas gonna do? What y'all niggas gonna get y'all gun and what? Yeah, nigga, I heard you was talking show it. Nigga, what, you mad? You mad because I said what, nigga, what? Who, you mad because what I said? You're not a hood? You not, you're not a hood? Wow. Wow. 
I am myself, bitch ass nigga. I got 76 people in here. So what that tell you, bitch? When you get on your live, you probably have zero people on there. I got genuine people on my shit. <laughs> bitch ass nigga. Genuine people. I'm a genuine person. I have on an ugly ass hoodie and some ugly ass jeans. You fucking idiot. <laughs> Why is niggas so butthurt? Niggas be trying to like do little, do little like tactics to make me be emotional. You're not gonna make me emotional. You're not gonna do that. It's not work. It's not gonna work. Just give up. Stop trying to make. Stop trying to get an emotional reaction. Like, damn, this nigga purpose never. He's never sensitive. I want to make him. You're not gonna make me sensitive. It's not gonna work. Just give up. <laughs> Please, I'm begging you. <laughs> okay, X didn't like me. Okay, great. You happy? You're so... You, nigga, you got a cat as your Abby. And you want me to feel your pain, right? <laughs> Why is niggas so emotional? This is what I'm trying to what is wrong with y'all? Who the fuck is that? What's up? Oh, no, no, no. I'm on, you know, I'm, I'm venting to the, I'm on the live stream right now talking to the fans about, you know, X and all that. You know what I'm saying? Alright. Be safe. But yeah. Like I was saying, um, <laughs> hey, hey, bitch, listen, man, y'all, y'all niggas act, y'all niggas is childish, dog. <laughs> okay, that that interview was like. 2016 before he got locked up. Anyways, I don't gotta explain myself to you bitch ass niggas, bro. <laughs> um, I'm pissed off <laughs> about this shit cause Me, me and Denzel had just talked about, you know, doing a song with X and shit. And literally just last week. Literally just last week, bro. <laughs> and we lost him, man. So, hey, the real God, please bless my trap. You got my reaction, though. You happy? There you go, buddy. I hope you, I hope you got your nut that you've been craving to swallow. You, 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 you happy?
happy you got that nut in your mouth? Did you swallow it good? How that nut taste? You been thirsting for that nut. You been wanting that nut in your mouth so bad, playboy. Yeah, the little fucking bitch. You been craving for some cum in your little faggot ass mouth. But yeah, anyways. Fucking bitch. <laughs> Nah, it ain't even low pause because we already know he's gay. So, why well, I say pause when I know he's a faggot. He wants, he wants to suck my dick. Like, he want to suck my dick. He want a dick in his mouth. But yeah, anyways. <sighs> um. I'm still trying to get over this shit. This situation. is like fucked up man X was a dark angel like me <laughs> and he fell victim to envy jealousy and greed <laughs> so That being said, I just really I want to I want to tell X um, since I never had a chance to tell you face to face like you know like a big brother. I want to say um, I want to say thank you for. Um, for keeping black land alive and I did my work and you you carried you know you, you got the torch and you carried it um <laughs> to me in my eyes, you, you're not going. You still here, bro. I know you still here. And, um, I got you. I got you, bro. I don't even like rap. I don't even like making music like that, but if I gotta come back and do this shit for you, then that's what I gotta do. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm gonna do it. Cause I know, I know you was hurt. I know I hurt you. When you was mad at me, when you was fussing me out and no jumpers and all that shit, you was disappointed in me because you was hurt. You 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 had faith in me, and uh, you always respected me as a big brother. You just didn't have time to tell me. You didn't have time to talk to me and shit, but. I'm proud of you. Um, and I just want to apologize to the fans. <laughs> for laying y'all down in the past.
But black people, we got to do better. We got to stop being jealous of each other. <laughs> We stupid. It's like somebody putting cheese over the rats and the rats just killing each other trying to get the cheese. That's all they doing to black people with money. They put hanging it over our head and making us kill each other over it. I don't even see what the fuck going on, bro. <laughs> Yo, black people, be proud of being black. Be proud of your skin color. And stop hating on each other, bro. Because Zimmerman's still out here. And y'all ain't do shit to Zimmerman yet. If I catch Zimmerman, I'm going to beat his ass. <laughs> so, I doubt George Zimmerman is that good at hiding. Because he's not. <laughs> um, yo, X, um, <laughs> I made sure Geneva got her ass whooped at your memorial, bro. <laughs> she deserved that shit. I know you still loved her or whatever, but I don't know the girl who 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 fought her, but I'm glad she got her ass whooped. <laughs> I put fuck Geneva and everybody knew what time it was. Bitch, you did not deserve. You did not deserve to even step foot near that memorial. I don't give a fuck how many times y'all made up. Bitch, if you really love him, you wouldn't have put him through all that shit. Because <laughs> if it wasn't for Geneva, X would still be alive. You know why? Because X would not be in Florida right now. X would be in a whole other side of the world. <laughs> but since they put X on papers and you had to sit still out in stupid ass South Florida, he had to fucking be around peasants. So blame Geneva for that shit. <laughs> Cause it's all her fault. Thanks a lot, Geneva. Stupid bitch. Thanks to you. Florida is just back to fucking shit. <laughs> Cause X was really keeping the torch lit. I can't I can't do this shit by myself. <laughs> so obviously obviously I needed help. And I had a lot of help from him, ski mask, Denzel, Puya, Fat Nick. Ghost Man, Kodak, all the street niggas out of Florida. It's levels to this shit. It's just like Atlanta. It's just like Atlanta. You got the you got the two lines, you got the keys, you got the fucking <laughs> off of records, then you got the fucking twenty one savages, then you got the fucking bank road freshes, then you got the motherfucking Gucci Mane and shit and all that shit. It's just like Atlanta, bro. <laughs> so, thanks a lot, Geneva. It's all your fault, bro. I don't give a fuck if y'all made up ten times after you fucking accused him of punching you in the fucking eye. After you fucked two dudes while he was locked up. I mean, it's, it's, the, it's the principles. I don't I don't condone anything that y'all speak on. I don't have nothing to do with that shit. But you made you made it viral. You made the world hate the man. I don't give a fuck. You could have kept that shit private, dog. 
keep keep your business to yourself. Cause I I doubt X would have fucking put your business out there on the internet if you cheating on him. So so thanks to Geneva. Like his thanks thanks a lot, Geneva. That's all I'm gonna say, bro. <laughs> Thanks a lot. And I know me and X used to troll each other when we had our fake ass beef, whatever. It wasn't even a real beef. It was all fucking publicity. It was fake as fuck. It was a publicity stunt, all right? X used to fucking troll me all the time and send fucking dick pics and fucking troll the shit out of me all fucking time. I used to be like, bro, what the fuck? I used to be fucking loud, like, yo. Wow, wow shit. This funny shit. This wild ass. You trolling, bro. I used to troll him all day. He's trolling me, bro. This. What? Alright, but I'm gonna say this shit, bro. Geneva, thanks a lot, bro. You deserve that ass whooping. <laughs> You deserve that. I'm glad you got your ass whooped at that fucking memorial, you stupid bitch. You a stupid ass bitch. Stupid asshole. Somebody should have hit your ass in the head with a shovel. Somebody should have hit Geneva in the head with a shovel, bro. I'm sorry. I would have hit... Bitch, bitch gonna bring a, a fucking globe. Stupid ass bitch. Like, people so childish, bro. Like, after all you and this man been through, you gonna bring a fucking a poster? Bitch, you should have brought a fucking. Bitch, you should have brought a, a fucking a something. You gonna bring a piece of paper? Stupid ass bitch. And then you gonna get mad because they burned it? Bitch, I'll bitch I'll burn it, bitch. I'll burn yo I burn your ass. The fuck? Bitch, you around here posting news and you still can't afford some some shit. You you still can't afford nothing? You you posting news and you still broke? Stupid ass bitch. <laughs> Bitch, your name Geneva at that. That's the fake Rolex. No, that's the fake Jacob watch, dumb bitch. So it's, it's already a wrap for you. Geneva. That's the fake Jacob watch. Get the fuck out of here. Bitch named you after a fake watch. Fake Jacob. Geneva. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Your name Geneva, bro. Your name Geneva. Is you serious? They named you after a fake Jacob watch, dog. Are you fucking kidding me? So you, it just thought it's your fault, bro. Like, nah, this shit's some real nigga shit. It's all your fault, bro. Like, stupid ass hoe. Her name is Liar. Wow. Her Instagram name is Liar. What kind of shit is that, bro? Bro, I'm, I'm about to I'm about to call it a day, man. This shit this shit stressing me out, bro. Stupid ass hoe. Bro, y'all see that bitch, bro? If y'all see Geneva in traffic, bro, just run that hoe over, bro. For real. I don't give a fuck. I ain't got shit to do with it anyway. Just pull a GTA 5 online, move on that hoe, just run that hoe over. Ain't nobody gonna know what happened. They just gonna see that bitch on the floor. What, what happened? Bitch, she just on the floor. I don't know what happened. 
Okay, man. All right. Because that shit crazy, bro. That shit is ridiculous, bro. Like, bitch, you don't upload it like 30 news on the internet and you still broke. Like, stupid ass bitch. <laughs> Yeah, you might as well create that bitch on GTA Online, kill that hoe, bro. But yeah, anyways. Yeah, I'm about to get out of here, man. X, man. Baby boy. I got you, dog. I got you, bro. It's just, it's just... I got you, man. Don't worry, dog. I don't know how I'm gonna do this, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try my best, man. <laughs> we live in a we we live in a weird ass time. I don't know even know to trust no one. <laughs> but yeah, X. Thank you. Thank you, dog. I appreciate it. Everything you did for the shit, for the, for the whole state, man. You took a lot of weight off my back. <laughs> and to all you niggas that hate talented people, all you niggas that feel like y'all deserve to be in the same spot talented people supposed to be in. Niggas, step your talent up. That's all I'm gonna say. Step your talent up. Nobody owe you niggas nothing. <laughs> Nobody owe you niggas shit. Owe yourself. Cause I damn sure don't owe you niggas nothing. I did what I had to do. That goes for black men. Because to be honest, black men in 2018, <laughs> guess what, y'all? We taking big L's. <laughs> That's right. Black men in 2018, we taking L's. You know why? Cause you motherfuckers don't get it yet. <laughs> Hopefully it won't be too late before you motherfuckers wake up though. Cause I ain't got time to sit here <coughs> and preach to you black motherfuckers all day. I got shit to do. Yo, X, I know you hear me. I know you hear. Because when you passed away that morning, I saw you. I saw you standing in the corner of my room. Shit was weird. I never saw, I never saw no shit like that. But I, I, I felt your presence in my room, and I wonder why I did. But I know you, I know you, I know you still out here, man. I got you, dog. I'm a f